what's up guys canadian gate here back with episode number 20 of the minnesota wild franchise gm mode series here on the channel the last episode we got eliminated in the playoffs in seven games after a comeback in game number seven we lose in overtime so in this episode we're going to go through the draft and the recent stage and leave it off in free agency oh that, that was a tough tough loss that was a tough loss coming back in the third period of tied up only to lose in overtime Man, and I like this. I like the team this year. It was a really, really deep team. But um, we won two straight. We lost two straight to end the series. We had a 3-2 series lead. We couldn't close it out. We got shot out twice in this series. Which is not a showing how this team plays because in the regular season, we couldn't stop scoring. So we're going to head into the draft here. Be retired players. This is the year three offseason. Corey Perry calls it quits. Same with Duncan Keith. Ryan Suter calls it a career. Oh, Ryan Suter. Thank you for all you have done. You, you were the second captain of this team, my man. I don't know why they didn't give you the C. Thank you, Ryan Suter, for all you have done. If you come back as a scout or a coach, I'm bringing you back. You better guarantee that. Thank you, Ryan Suter, for your time. You are awesome, man. Ryan Suter calls it a career. Keith Yandel, Corey Perry, Braden Colburn, Valtteri Fiopiola, Nielsen, Carter Buck, Erickson and Bacchus, goaltending, Halak, Anderson, Grice, McElhaney, I'll call it a career. Tell me Ryan Suter's a scout now. Come on. He's now a coach. I'm bringing him back. Oh, Luke Lindenny called it a career too. Your players that are now a scout. Luke Lindenny. Are you good? Like, No, you're not that good. Luke Lindenny. Uh, I would have you go to the OHL, but I'll sign you as a, as a scout. All right. Continue simming. Yeah, Glendening comes back as a scout. And we're here at the draft. You you best believe I'm being rented her back to be a coach on this team. Like, that that's a guarantee. So let's head into the draft. Have you number three. The Red Wings still picking first overall, and they select Connor Bedard, 85 overall, high franchise. That's the player that's going to turn around their franchise right there. Connor Bedard. Montreal, they get Matt V. Mitchkoff. They won't complain about this one. Pierce Sniper. Nashville, they select Wade Keith. Power forward, they won't complain. New Jersey, still picking top five. They select Adam Fantilli. Columbus, they select Theo Lindstein, another defenseman. They won't complain. Let's hit our pick here at number 20. Let's see what was taken before us. So you have Pedersen, Brunstrom, Dower Nielsen, Rolison, Willie Height, Kapanen, Varlamov, Gortz, Meyer, Grellinger, Lettinen, Sexsmith, Martin, Sheen, and now us. So what's on the board here? Jalen Boyd. Damien Wyman. Jose Bradford. Similar as, as Ryan O'Reilly. Uh, do I go with the American or the Canadian? Damien Wyman. Injury prone. Uh, hold on. Let me just see. Third line. Mm. Jose Bradford. I'm going to take Damian Wyman here. Here at pick 20. Top 6. 65 overall. Love to see what um, Bradford is. 
Bradford, same thing. Okay, so I didn't miss out on anything there. Hits our pick here in the fourth round because we gave up our second and third. Here in the fourth round now. Lebda. Brian Matthews. Andrew Lebda. Ryan Winterton. Winterton. Uh, Jasper Peltier. Callie Shodin. No one really here. Rudolph Wenberg. Uh, let's go Lebda here, centerman. Bottom six. Uh, he's actually a left winger. Never mind. I lied to you guys. Fifth round. Victor Hudobin. Tristan Zan Zandi. I'll take Rudolf Wenberg here. Goaltender. Out of the Swedish Hockey League. Fringe starter. 175 here in the sixth round. Thomas Johnson, Josh Philman, Sergei Kuznetsov, Tyler McKenzie, Ola Enkvist, Brent Himmen, bottom six. In the seventh round, final pick of the draft. Sally Spencer, Lambert, Jacob Zach. Bigger. I'll take Zach Bigger here. Medium 7th D, and that's going to do it for the draft. All right, so Damien Wyman being our top pick. All right, resign stage. I'll leave all those guys. I'll leave all that. Okay. So we should have some money now that Suter retired, and we do. Okay. Goaltending. 89 overall. Uh, Talbot, you played your last game here. Thank you for your service. Lennon Bow, I wouldn't mind bringing you back for the AHL squad. I'll go one year again for him. Hunter Jones is up to a 76. He's close. Uh, defenseman. Dumba wants back. Balamaki. Dermot doesn't. Seamus Casey. He's another year in college hockey for him. But, um, Behrens, he's coming in now. A lot of our defensemen are up this year. Johansson, you're coming back. Uh, Enright. We're bringing Enright. Isaac Enright, former sixth round pick. Medium top six. Beliveau. I don't think I bring in Beliveau. Seventh round defenseman. I'll let him go. Evan Naus. Seventh D. Seventh rounder. I can let him go. Uh, I'll bring in Enright. Former sixth round pick. Fedor Gordiev. One year for this guy. And if he doesn't improve anything this year, he can be let walk. Ben Thomas. I can let him go. Oh, let's go to the top here. Matt Dumba. Do I bring in Matt Dumba again? I think I do. This is a lot of money, though. Balamaki. That's also a lot of money. Dermot doesn't want to come back. He was a rental. Letting him go. Kalen Addison. Bring you in on three-year contract worth 1.5. Thank you for that. Rathbone. I can bring you in on a two-year contract two-way. Ian Mitchell, same thing. Two year, two way. Thank you. Gross. Let you go. Sealer. I can bring you back. One year deal. It's all of those defensemen. Except for these guys. Uh, right wing. Uh, Stillman, we're going to sign you. I've liked your development over the past couple of years. Possible. Uh, I can bring you in on a one-year contract for the AHL. 
Ty Ratty. What have you done in AHL for us? Not bad. Not bad. I'll bring you in. Continue to be a sniper down there for us. Ladina or Ladnia. Bring you back. Two year contract. Do Jaime. I can let you go. Same thing with Will Bitten. I'll let you go. Uh, left wing. We got Greenway, Kaprizov, Fiala, Zuccarell outside. Zucker, I wouldn't mind bringing back. I'll do that. One year, 3.5. Tuft, how did you do down there? 28 points in 76 games. Uh, could be a fourth liner. I'll bring you in. Ooh, you want money. I'll, ten I'll tender you for now. Kiwi Ranta, how did you do? 41 points. Uh, I'll bring you in. One year deal. Stromgren. For a fifth round pick. I I'll bring you in. Hamelainen. Doc is still there. Alright, centers. Uh, Lockhart. Medium top six. I feel like I have to. Giroux, I haven't even played you down there. I'll let you go. Mayhew, one-year deal for you. Nico Sturm, not going to bring back. Bozak, not bringing bring him back. And then Sean Monahan. Fairly decent contract for Monahan. Oh, what do I do with Monahan? I think I'm going to wait on him. So UFAs, we got two big ones. RFA, a couple of big ones there. So it's a fancy day. We get Mitchell. We get Bo. We got Kibi Ranta. Zucker doesn't come back on that deal. That's exactly what you wanted, though, isn't it? $24 million still to work with. Okay. $24 million for, those, for these three guys. I can definitely do that. It's definitely doable. But I got Valmaki as well. Uh, Yusuf Valamaki. I really, really want to see some growth in this guy. It goes six years, or seven years, 5.5. 5. That should work. But I'm going to, I can't tend to you right now. Uh, UFA Zucker. Bring you back one year, 3.750. Simulated day. Valmaki doesn't like that deal. Okay. I'll just tender you for now. UFAs. Dumba or Monahan. If I can lower this a bit. 5.5 for 6 for Monahan. Dumba, five years at seven. That's about 13 mil. We bring back Monaghan. We bring back Dumba. $10 million to sign Valamaki. Seven years, 5.850. Simulated that. He doesn't like that. Okay. Uh, seven years, six. He comes back. We got all of our guys back. All right. So goaltending, we need a backup. But Kalkin is still there. Defense took a hit with Suter retiring, but we're still good. Dumba, Spurgeon, Velmaki are all back long term. Brodine's still here long term. Addison's got more playing time. Rathbone should make the team. Mitchell maybe even might make the team. Seamus Casey. He's going to be signed next year, but he's still in college hockey for this year. All right. Beeren's going to make his AHL debut. Uh, Forward-wise. So first line, Kaprizov, Eriksenek, and Zuccarello. Second line being Fiala, Rossi, and Greenway. Third line being Johnson, Monaghan, and Zucker. Fourth line being Boldy. Um, maybe even Toft and Shaw. About $5 million to get 
get some things done. Okay. We're still looking very good, guys. Yeah, we're still sitting really good. Okay. Any of our untimed guys I want to sign? No, no, no. Flyman, no. For Kunin, probably let's let him walk. Varol, still 18. I'll, I'll wait. Wiesblatt, Warren. Uh, I'll wait on all these guys. Simulate. All those scouts are gone, but I'll bring them back. Don't worry. Um, there is one thing I want to do before I wrap it up. And that is offer Ryan Suter a gig. But first, I just want to see what he is. What is Ryan Suter? What kind of scout is he? Or coach, I should say. Ryan Suter, associate coach. Of course, he's going to teach defensemen. Um, Minichal assistant coach I give you the three years as much as I can to come back as a, as a coach for us that means we've got to bump down our assistant coach Reitz you go down the goalie coach for now So hopefully, um, Ryan Suter accepts that deal. Free agency. I, I need a backup goalie. Just on a one-year deal. Oh my gosh. Uh, goaltending. Score by overall. Bishop for only that much. Lankinen for only that much. Sorrows for only that much. You see Sorrows. Dang. Uh, Lankinen. Okay. Um, Bishop. Could bring in Ben Bishop. But he wants two years, never mind. Ilya Sorokin. He was really good for Bridgeport at the AHL. I'll bring him in. One year, one way. Worth one one point two five zero. Defenseman. One of mine. I'm bringing in someone here. Graves. Ryan Graves. Defensive defenseman. We don't even know. Ooh, Connor Timmins. Uh, Giordano. Ooh, Giordano. Veteran guy. Gavrikov. I like Graves here with this. He's 28. We can give him like a three-year or two-year deal. Get that money down at 1.5. We can even go after like someone else as well. Eric Johnson. Who has the best defensive awareness here? Our best defensive category. Uygar, Gilbert. Who's this? Dennis Gilbert. Uh, what overall? 79? How much does he want? A two-way deal? Okay. Bring you in. Forwards. Best defensive category that I can sign. Andrew Cop. Could bring you in. Let's do that. One year, 1.750. Highmore. Eh. JT Comfer. Okay, so four guys that I'm going to try and sign. All right, 
I'm actually going to pause it here, and I'm going to go with Sentinel Scouts, and I'll see if we get those guys. Okay, so we're here now. Let's simulate on, see if we get those guys. Suter comes in as a coach. Yes. Okay, that's good. Essa Heinen comes in. A scout comes in. Scout. 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 Another scout. Final scout. Andrew Kopp comes in. Grace comes in. Sorokin comes in. Gilbert comes in. That's everybody. We got all of our guys. Okay. Let's take a look at this team now. Uh, goaltending, Kapanen, or Kakunen, and Sorokin are just going to be the tandem. Defensemen, Dumba, Spurgeon, Valamaki, Brodeen, Graves, Addison. That's their sixth. Gilbert, the seventh. Still no right wingers. That's, that's crazy. But all these guys can play the right side. Marco Rossi, how much does he want on an extension? <clears throat> Jesus. I like the addition of Sean Monaghan. I really do. Good third. He's going to be in like an excellent third liner for us. Andrew Kopp being the fourth liner. John to be on the left wing. Shaw. That, I think that makes Shaw expendable. How much does Zuccarello want on a contact extension? The same amount? You want to raise, my friend? Huh, you wish. Okay. Uh, let me just browse the trading blocks. See if there's anything out there. Defenseman wise. So no. Ekman Larson. They're sellers. Ekman Larson, that's a lot of value and a lot of money. Four years left. Can't do that. Uh Skinner. No. Brady Shea. Now he is on a one year deal. Got some value to him. Eh, not really. Brady Shea. Doesn't fit though. Uh no. No. Jonathan Taste made the way to Dallas. No. 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 Ooh, Sean Walker. Sean Walker. No. He, I, thought he, I thought he was better than what he was. Dushane and Alice. No. 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 No, 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 and no. Okay, so we're pretty much team is pretty much set. Um, don't think there's anything else that we really need to do. Let's just simulate on here, see what the team looks like for the start of year number four. I have high hopes for this team, man. We are a great team this year. I think we only got better. We held on to both of our rentals. Really Tuft comes back. We held on to both our rentals except for Travis Dermott. We let him go. So two of the three. Uh, we had the cap spaces bring in more guys to help us out. We brought back Dumba. We brought back Valamaki. We brought in Andrew Kopp, who is better than Glenn Denning, who is better than, than Helm, who is better than Bozak. And the further development of our guys... And the increased depth that we have now just makes this team that much better. Okay, so let's set it up how I think it should be. Kaprizov, Eriksson Ek, Zuccarello, Fiala, Rossi, and Greenway. Uh, Zucker on the right side. Johnson on the left. Kopp in the middle. Boldy. Isn't Shaw can even be there? I guess. Defenseman. Valamak, uh, Dumba and Valamaki. Uh, Spurgeon and Brodeen. Graves and Addison. Switch that. Then goal is Ily Kapil Kakinen and Ilya Sorokin. Then extra goal and be extra defensive being Dennis Gilbert. Let me call up two other players here. We send down Rathbone. Let's call up Tuft and 
Kurashev to be the extra forwards. Jones is a 78 now. All right. Smith and Shaw on the fourth line, though. I don't know if I like that. Sankoma's going to be in the AHL with Stillman up, up there. Is there anyone I can get a plus one up there with? Colton Doc, so I'll do that. Coviola with Mayhew, or can I put... Eh. Two way forward. Two way forward. I'll keep it like this. Defenseman, yep. B runs there, yep. Sealer, you come out. Cameron, why not you go in? The end right, Johansson, Hunt, Oathman, Novak are there. Okay. Then extra forwards up here being Kurashev and Tuft. I might want Tuft instead of Mason Shaw, though. Yeah, I want Riley Tuft here. Put you there. You can switch with him. There you go. Riley Tuft fits in fine as a power forward on that fourth line. Look at this team, guys. It's coming together really nicely. This is a very good team, a very deep team. We got a better chance. We got the be like a best chance to like anybody else. It's a great team. I, I just wish Eric Jeanette got a little bit better. I wish he got to like 86, 87, 8 overall. But that's okay. What would happen if I did this? Plus three up there and then the negative here or the neutral here. I might go to that if we're struggling, but I want to keep the guys together. Top six has been the same for two years now. Well, three years and in, like insert Rossi over, over, um, what's his name? Damn, who is that other center we had? Victor Rask. That's right. Okay, so we need a new assistant captain. So that could be... I don't want to give it to Greenwood just yet. So Spurgeon's still the captain. Eric's an the assistant. And... Who do I give the, the A to? Uh, Jason Zucker. He deserves it. He's been with the Wild forever. There you go. Okay. I'm going to wrap it up here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, leave a like. If you want to see more content like what you just saw, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next episode.